know, just from today, uh, again, it's the first day, and uh, excited to get back out there. I know our kids, our coaching staff was itching to get back on the field. And, you know, it was, I was pleased with um, really the effort, you know, and, and it's probably a little bit longer of a practice than, than it's been in the past. Um, but, you know, those guys found a way to continue to go through it. And, you know, you got to be able to get reps with the ones, twos, threes, and see some young guys in there. So I was pleased as an overall picture just being out there. Um, I look forward to going back and watching this film and, and really continue to work out the details. But, you know, like any day one, you knew the energy would be there. Um, you know, this is a starting point, and we have to continue to move forward from here. I don't have my list here, but off the top of my head, I know the guys that we won't expect to see the first game is, is Joe Wilkins and uh, um, what's, uh, Mitch Evans, um, J.D. Price. You know, those are the three off the top of my head that um, we know will be out for the first game. Uh, and then the rest of the guys, we expect to, to be ready to go September 3rd. Now, there's a progression for some guys getting back. Um, you know, we can't just go zero and put them in there 100. So we have some guys on limited limited reps, obviously, uh, Logan Diggs. And uh, we got Maris Lee Aval on some limited reps today. But um, for the most part, those three are the guys that we know will be out for the first game. Um, and then we expect those other guys that may have limited reps um, today to be ready to roll. Again, I, I know what it's like to, to be in a busy locker room, being on the other side of the field. This is about Notre Dame football. And I know. Some of the headlines will be me going back to my alma mater, but my focus point is Notre Dame football and preparing this team. And then we get to September 3rd, um, Ohio State got to be your opponent. Now, the great thing is it's a great opponent, right? And what better way to challenge yourself and to see where we are as a team than to face an opponent like that? But this has nothing to do with you know, me going back to my alma mater. This is about Notre Dame playing Ohio State. I love the competition aspect of it. You know, I think. You know, competition really helps people grow, but as soon as we're ready to name a starting quarterback, we're, we're going to do it. We're not waiting um, for a certain time, a certain days, but we just need to make sure we're ready to name a starting quarterback and we will. Yeah, I think we have a, really it's a, a two-quarterback battle right now between Tyler and Drew. Um, I think they all had major strides in the spring. You know, Tyler missed the last two practices. One was being the spring game and, and the practice before that, but you know, he got 13 really good practices in. And, and you know, I thought both of those guys had extremely um, good spring. You know, and then Steve and Ronnie, you know, those guys had good springs in terms of progression, right? And, and um, but what you'll see is is Drew and Tyler battle it out, and they both get reps with the ones. And, and again, when, when myself and Coach Reese and the offensive staff feel um, it's to a point where there's a, a quarterback that has said that's clearly showed us that he's the starter, um, we'll name him.